field hockey program here at Loomis has helped me to kind of grow into the person that I am, help me be comfortable in the skin I'm in, and definitely a good work ethic, working hard and having fun at the same time. Loomis is a place where you're challenged both academically and in your athletics, and that's what really brought me here. I really wanted a place that would kind of push me to be my best self, um, to push me to be better each and every day. I'm Bobby Moran. I'm the head field hockey coach here at Loomis Chafee. I have been here for 11 years now. We are definitely a team that's about process, not product. We're thinking about the little things that we can do every single day that make us better in the long run. I do want to play sports at the next level. I think Loomis helps prepare you for that a lot because it helps you manage your time and keeps the intensity of the sport up and keeps you devoted. I think a lot of programs focus just on the physical nature of the game and you can only get so far if you do that. You've got to look at the kid from the all different perspectives, how she's doing emotionally, how she's feeling socially, how she's doing academically. All of those pieces roll into how she's going to play for me on Wednesday and Saturday. Coach Moran is a really great support for everything I do on campus, field hockey, academics. If I'm having any troubles, I, can, I know I can go and talk to her. Whether my player is going to play field hockey in college or ice hockey in college or lacrosse in college or play basketball or whatever it is that she wants to do, I want to help them, I want to be a part of that process for them. But it begins freshman year. We talk about different clinics that they can get involved in, different coaching things that they can go to, uh, different showcases, and then we move them through the process, hopefully helping them find the best possible fit. We've had really good success. She makes you feel so good when you do, when you pull that play off and you score a goal or you finally get past a defenseman or stop their player that you have been trying to all season. I love setting up a practice and then being able to pull a kid out and talk with them one-on-one -on -one and say, you know what, you're doing this really well, but let's focus on this piece today. And giving them little tiny snippets of things that they can work on and watching them then do it is, it's awesome. I love, I love watching them do that. Make sure that you're receiving it right in the middle of your stand. You're pulling it here, bringing it into the middle of your stance. When you go to send it back, it's from the midline right back, so you've got to get low. Have a great time out there. Play hard. This is your game, your field. October is Breast Cancer Awareness Month, and so for us, we do a huge Play for the Cure game in October. The kids get involved. They sell uh, t-shirts and they sell wristbands. The girls get in pink. It's a blast. They have a great time, and they're raising money and awareness for a great cause. I love the team camaraderie. I feel like instead of being just a team, we're more of a family, and it's great having um, a family away from home. I am looking for smart, young, confident kids who want to work hard. I want to look for kids who have a great attitude and who love being a part of something bigger than themselves. That's really important to me. Playing on a team is one of the most important things you can do at school and being a part of that support group and always having them there to back you up on and off the field is amazing and so I love being with them all the time which is my favorite part. Let's <laughs> go.